I'm trying to make it go bigger with the poop. We can. Yeah. Wanna go right now? Sure. Thank you, Zemi. Okay, we're leaving. We're gonna get used to this whole camera thing. Ooh, I should get in it. Hey! <laughs> Patrick. I can't believe we're finally standing here today. I don't think I could possibly love you any more than I do right now, but I've said that before and somehow my love for you continues to grow. We have been through so much together through our six wonderful years together and it has only prepared us for this exact day. I've never been more confident in any other decision I've had to make, the decision of spending the rest of my life with you. I'm sure you're going to say that you're the lucky one to be marrying me, but the truth is I'm the lucky one. Ashley, committing to you today is one of the easiest things I will ever have to do. Like any good banker, I did my due diligence and I think that six and a half years worth of data and information is enough to complete my analysis. By the way, Josh, did we get that background check yet? No? Uh, doesn't matter. The truth is, it took a fraction of our time together for me to realize I wanted to spend the majority of my time on this earth in your presence. You are my perfect counterpart in every way and have helped me to become the somewhat put together man that I am today. Without your support and guidance through the good times and the bad, I would be lost. Where I have weaknesses or shortcomings, you have enough strength to carry us both forward. I enjoy the private, simple moments I have with you as much as the giant, extravagant ones. I will spend our lives trying to live up to the expectations you have of me. And if I only meet them halfway, we're still gonna be incredibly rich and famous. You are everything and so much more than I ever knew I wanted in a wife. I promise to reflect that as your husband. People typically say that their significant other is their best friend or their hero or their inspiration. But the best way I know how to sum up just how much I love you is to say, you are my lobster. wedded wife and do you solemnly promise to love her honor her cherish her in sickness and in health in prosperity as well as adversity for better or worse forsaking all others so long as you both shall live I do and Ashley do you take Patrick to be your lawful wedded husband and do you solemnly promise that you will love honor and cherish him in sickness and in health in prosperity as well as adversity for better or worse, forsaking all others so long as you will show them. You may now kiss your bride. You know a relationship is going to be great and long lasting when the pair can enjoy lounging around watching Harry Potter movie marathons. <laughs> Sampling craft beer and having cute nicknames for each other. Like Pookie and Cream Pie. <laughs> but enough about me and Pookie. I'm truly lucky to have shared the experiences that we've had with such a fun and down to earth couple. And I look forward to it. So, how did we all get here today? As our college days continued, Ashley soon began the hots for this boy named Patrick. <laughs> Ashley was smitten over Patrick and even told me one day, Babe, I'm going to marry that boy one day. And I looked at her, handed her a shot, and said, Little stop, we don't say things like that. <laughs> would be madly in love with each other, and today they would be sharing their vows to be with each other for a lifetime. I just planned on it. I just want to ask somebody, will you love this girl as much as I love her? 
And I figured if they said, well, yes, or sure, I mean, shoot them. <laughs> I didn't even know that. But Patrick came to ask me for Ashley's hand, and he sat on my couch, wringing his hands, looking like he was about to have a heart words, he wanted to be a better person for us. It was not that he had goals, that he had aspirations, that he wanted to provide for the people's life. He told me in very eloquent words that he couldn't quite understand how he was so lucky to receive the gift he had found in Ashley. That he was in love with her. He knew I'm in love with her. I can't wait to spend another day with her. And I have to be better. And I'm happy to be better for me. I have to be better for her. May the road rise up to meet you. May the wind always be at your back. May the sun shine warm upon your face and, and the rain soft upon your fields. And if until we meet again, and God hold you the palm of his hand. Please wish them a, a long, healthy life filled with happiness, love, and success. Video, you're dead to me.